So anyway, ever since the Dylan Mulvaney uh, marketing fiasco with uh, Anheuser-Busch, as it turns out, you know, uh, sales of not just uh, Bud Light, but uh, Bud, Michelob Ultra, Bush Light, also are tanking. And now the big winner in this is Molson Coors. That's the company that makes uh, Coors Light and also Miller Light, the champagne of bottled beers. And n number one, of course, Coors Light is delicious, just saying. But now their sales are set to go up 12% year over year and a 5% increase in revenues. Yeah, the fallout from Bud Light is actually helping other companies. Molson saw an 11.8% year over year increase in net sales and a 5% increase in financial volumes in the second quarter. And Modelo Especial is it, the Mexican beer. That has overtaken Bud Light as the most popular beer in the U.S. Number one. Yeah. Listen, I don't drink uh, Bud Light. I choose to drink uh, Corona. More on that later as the show develops. But Not Modelo. I, How do you compare Modelo to Corona? I, I don't see any. I, I don't see any uh, comparison. Any yeah. comparison. But I just feel Modelo bad. is richer, right? And it's got a, a fat body. I know the, I the bottle. bottles are cute. Uh, the bottles are cute. Yeah, they are. I don't think people are looking for cute bottles at this point. The girls are. Think you're gonna get yourself the girls in trouble? Are. Still stuff the fat right, body. right. Yeah, it's true. It's got a fat. <laughs> I don't want two hands. They're so okay. cute, those little glass ones. With can the can I just say what I'm feeling bad about is the distributors, the people that deliver the Bud Light, I the know, people that work the in the workers. bottle plants. Uh, I, th I just feel terrible for them because they're paying the price. One person, I think, uh, I guess got suspended. Did she lose her job? I don't know who it was. Uh, but the executives still get paid the same. The, the whole thing is tanking, but the blue collar people that deliver it, let alone drink it. Do they get paid the by the hour? Is that well, why? or they lose their routes. The, the, oh. They don't fill up. They, they buy those routes. They fill up their truck. They deliver it up until two months ago. I have right. never in my lifetime seen a boycott stick around, have such sustainability as this. And there's no marketing behind it. It's all organic. Well, maybe those employees can go over to the companies that are doing better because they're probably hiring more people. Sure. Yeah. So you don't think Bud Light could come back? No, they're saying no. Uh, yeah, a, said no. One, one said of the that distributors that. said uh, customers made a choice. They left Bud Light and they are not coming back. If they come back, it's going to be a long time from now. Yeah, I listened to Joe Rogan yesterday. He was on the air with country music star Zach Bryan, who, AJ, you should book him. He's very good. Uh, but they both drank Bud Light on purpose. They said, we got to start pushing back. Uh, and I'm just wondering if things like that would happen. If there's a major push with things like the NFL, or the NBA, when if they just get these people to start drinking Bud Light, maybe not during the For, game. Forget about brands. But Coors Light is just a better tasting so? beer. Absolutely. That's right. the. I mean, I love, I love the marketing. The I, I love the marketing on that. Don't they still have the cans that are to tell you when it's cold enough? Uh, they oh, did yeah. for a while. Yeah. Right. They yeah. just the right temperature. Yeah, they they would change color. Mm -hmm. Right. The the can would. Like a pop up uh, timer. Right. Yes, but they. You know what? Another good one is Blue Moon, and they make a 99-calorie Blue Moon. It's called Blue Sky, I believe. It's hard to find, so if you see okay. it in the grocery store, there'll be, like, one case of it. Buy it. Right. Buy it and then resell it for more. We are two hours... I will buy it from you for double. Two hours and eight <laughs> minutes away it. from happy hour here on Fox <laughs> I Friday. am so hungry for, for a beer. I'm Steve Ducey. I'm Brian Kilmeade. And I'm Ainsley Earhart. And click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis.